How is up guys? So today we're going to continue our locomotion system and we're going to replace our third person character with a meta human, okay? So in the previous videos we only live retargeted the animations and put the meta human on top. In this one we are going to completely replace the third person character, okay? So this will work with any meta human with any body type, okay? So let's begin. Uh, first thing we need is to import our metahuman. So let's go to Quixel content. Okay, I'm going to use this one. Okay, now enable all the missing plugins. And before you restart, let's go to settings, plugins, search for Alembic Groom check this one and restart so this will make sure the hair will show up on package builds <clears throat> okay now we can close all of this and the first thing we're going to do is go to our meta human that we imported open the blueprint okay and uh what we're going to do is basically go to every single part of the meta human and assign it to the base skeleton to the sk mannequin okay so uh because since the skeletons are compatible we can just assign um the skeletons to the meta human and they will work okay so uh i'll show you let's go to the body here <clears throat> you can follow this and now right click skeleton assign skeleton select the sk mannequin right here and accept okay and that's it now do the same thing to all the other parts so to the feet right here assign skeleton sk mannequin accept okay now the legs Okay, now the torso, so like this, and finally the face, so we can follow this, assign skeleton, okay, and that's it. Um, now we need to go to our third person character, okay so let's find our third person character and right here we're going to copy all the parts uh not the body okay so copy and paste them here now select the torso the face the legs and the feet and drag to the mesh like this and now reset all the values make sure you reset all and now on the mesh we can now set our body to the meta human body like this and now we should be playing the animation um now we need to attach the body parts so we need to go to our construction script right here we're going to say set master pose to the feet for example and now we can also get the legs and the face okay connect to the targets like this now get the mesh connect right here and if we compile everything should be working okay now we can test this out so the animations are working but our feet are stuck to the ground okay this is because we need to fix our control rig okay so let's do that um, we can go to the mesh here and open this up now we can click here to go to the skeleton and on the root we're going to add a virtual bone to the root right here call it root now on this one we're going to add a virtual bone to the foot right first so foot right and then again on the vb roots add virtual bone to the foot left okay and call it foot 
left like this uh we can save this now we need to go to our control rig so we can go to our character and on the animation blueprint we can follow it open it up let's go to the animation graph and open the control rig um, now we need to refresh this control rig so that uh, the new bones show up here on these boxes okay so uh, for that we can select rig hierarchy right here select the root right click refresh and right here you're going to select the queen so skm queen not simple okay queen and that's it now this is going to take some time because it's going to refresh the entire skeleton Here we go. Okay, now compile save. Now we need to replace the IK bones. So here we're going to set this to VB foot L. Now VB foot R on this one. Now uh, over here, the same thing. So VB foot L on this one, VB foot R. And right here as well, VB foot L and VB foot R. Okay, now compile save. Uh, and that's it. So uh, if we save everything and hit play, we should be able to use all the animations and this meta human character. Okay, so uh, that's it. I hope you liked it. I hope you learned something with it. And don't forget to subscribe.